Fashion lovers and lovelies, welcome back to my channel. It's Kennedy Jazz. I am so excited to see you guys. And for all of my newcomers, welcome. My channel is all about luxury, lifestyle, and fashion. And I'm basically going to take you guys on an adventure of my life. So today, I have something very, very informative for you. It's going to be fun, but yet informative. This video has never been done before. I have looked everywhere for this video it has not been done i don't know why but i am going to be the first person to do a video about this about the difference between lubitin which is red bottoms and lewis button yes they are very different and people don't know i didn't even know before i, I you know got informed about it so without further ado, let me just get into this video and let me give you the differences between these two so you will never make this mistake again, okay? First off, I'm just so excited to be the first person ever in the history of ever to do this video. Like, hopefully, you know, this is like my my time, right? So it all started because before like, I was able to afford all of my children, <laughs> I went to Louis Vuitton searching for a pair of red bottoms guys right i was asking the essay i'm like hey where's your shoes and he's like well the shoes are right here i'm like no your shoes like the red bottoms your shoe your shoes he's like what are you talking about i was like your shoe the red bottoms the red bottoms he's like oh no ma'am he was like oh my god he's like this happens all the time he said no there was baton and louis Vuitton is totally different they are both french of course they both sound the same but they are different and I'm like, oh my gosh. I had an epiphany, like that's when the light came on. I'm like, oh my God, they're different. It really like taught me. So like now, as you can see, I have a collection even up here of the red bottoms. I love them so much. This is my first pair for my 22nd birthday. And this is my first Louis Vuitton purchase right here. I have showed you guys this video. You've seen many pictures of me in it. I'm not too crazy about, I am, I love Louis Vuitton, don't get me wrong, but it's like everybody has it, and it's not as, to me, it's not as special anymore, and to me, it's not as like, I have to have it because they are, there are so many fakes out there now, like, it just kind of depreciates the value of the bag, but this is Louis Vuitton, this is the signature monogram right here. So let me get into the differences about these two so you will never be lost again. So I have my little book right here just to keep note. Even though like I do know them, I want to make sure this is smooth and I do get the point across. So the difference between Louis Vuitton, L-O-U-B-O-U-T-I-N, which is the red bottom shoes, they were founded in 1991. And Louis Vuitton, V-U-I-T-T-O-N, was founded in 1854. So over a hundred years, LV has the, the lead in luxury, right? So Louis Vuitton, he was known for his traveling cases, his traveling bags. He was so popular that he even worked for Napoleon III. That just tells you something about this exquisite luxury brand, you know? They both originate in France. Louis Vuitton and Louis Vuitton both do handbags, shoes, fragrances, but Louis Vuitton is more renowned for his red sole shoes, as you can see, the red soles, and Louis Vuitton is known for his handbags. In reference to popularity, I think LV definitely has an upper hand because they have been around for the longest, 1854, and he has more than 460 stores in 50 different countries. And Louis Vuitton, red bottoms, he has 150 stores located in 35 different countries. So, yes, LV is definitely more ahead, but for shoes, honey, I'm all about my red bottoms, okay? My favorite, out of all of the different designer shoes that I own, I think Louboutin has my heart the most. This is another pair that I own right here. They both hold the title for the best Lux brand. Um, from 2006 to 2012, LV was noted the best luxury brand, and 
Louboutin is the reason stilettos came back to vogue, came back to mainstream back in the 90s. That should tell you something. I'm not gonna say what television company this was, but they, I was like looking on Facebook and I came across a very famous woman um, and we're doing an article on her outfit. And they were like, she's wearing Louis Vuittons. I'm all about Louis Vuittons, y'all. I love my red bottoms, okay? So I'm like, oh, what pair is she wearing? So I look and they were actually Louis Vuitton with the V shoes. And I'm like, I, I'm like, y'all, really? Like, how are you gonna be this huge TV company and not even know the differences between two fashion iconic brands? I'm like, and I wrote on the comment section, I'm like, those are Louis Vuitton, not Christian Louboutins. And I'm like, like, how are y'all gonna like, come on now, step it up, honey. If I could pick a favorite, it will be very hard for me to pick a favorite because why? Yes, even though Louis Vuitton has his purses, I would go more so towards LB purses, but when it comes to shoes, even though LB shoes are super cute, I think I have to stick with red bottoms. I feel like he is always going to be the king of kings of, of shoes. I'm sorry, I think he already made his mark, but yeah, I think I'm sticking with him. Even though I love LB, I love LB shoes. I'm I gotta stick with my bloody shoes, you know? LV is renowned for leather bags, his trunks, shoes, but Louboutin is known for his shoes, handbag, perfume, makeup. So they honestly is both a win-win. Even though Louis Vuitton has been around longer, Louboutin has made his, his name in American fashion. I have this LV book. It's a coffee table book, but I kind of use it for like my fashion room, but it's a really cool book. I'm like, open it. It, just, it shows you all the, um, from beginning to end of how LB got started. It shows these pictures from the runway. Very cool pictures. And the Louboutin book is so lovely. It's so pretty. Let's show you guys this. It like pops open. If I can like get like an angle for you guys, it pops open. This isn't that beautiful. I thought it was so nice, but this shows you all the magnificent shoes. I won't mess my book up, but it's pretty cool. Shows you how he got started, a little bit about about his background. All my lovely shoes. Well guys, that would be all. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was informative for you guys. I had a lot of fun making it because I was the first one to do it. I'm marking that right now. Mark my words. Kennedy Jazz was the first person to do a video on Louis Vuitton and Louis Vuitton and what makes them different and what makes them the same. So I made history a little bit too now. So guys, yes, um, this is all I have for you guys today. Thank y'all so much for watching. Please, please share, subscribe, and comment. And tell me what, you know, if you learned something new or your favorite brand when it comes to Louis Vuitton and Louis Vuitton. Tell me in the comment section. Share, share, share. And don't forget you are fashionable, you are lovely, and you belong in luxury. Bye, y'all.